Good morning. Today we'll be doing the Liturgy of the Hours Morning Prayer for Sunday, May 29th. Let's go through the pages. For the breviary, our hymn is on page 1345, Antiphon is at 959, and the Psalms at 1365. Then we return to 959 for the reading. Christian prayer book is hymn number 17, 579 for the antiphon, 856 for the psalms, and back to 579 for the reading. Let's have a moment of silence as we begin our prayer. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. The Lord is King, robed in splendor, Alleluia. The Lord is King, with majesty and robe. The Lord has robed himself with might. He has girded himself with power. The world you made firm, not to be moved. Your throne has stood firm from of old, from all eternity, O Lord, you are. The waters have lifted up, O Lord. The waters have lifted up their voice. The waters have lifted up their thunder. Greater than the roar of mighty waters, more glorious than the surging of the sea, the Lord is glorious on high. Truly, your decrees are to be trusted. Holiness is fitting to your house, O Lord, until the end of time. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The, the Lord, Lord is King, robed in splendor. Alleluia. All creation will be freed. All peoples will know the glory and freedom of God's children. Alleluia. Bless the Lord, all you works of the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Angels of the Lord, bless the Lord. You heavens, bless the Lord. All you waters above the heavens, bless the Lord. All you hosts of the Lord, bless the Lord. Sun and moon, bless the Lord. Stars of heaven, bless the Lord. Every shower and dew, bless the Lord. All you winds, bless the Lord. Fire and heat, bless the Lord. Cold and chill, bless the Lord. Dew and rain, bless the Lord. Frost and chill, bless the Lord. Ice and snow, bless the Lord. Nights and days, bless the Lord. Light and darkness, bless the Lord. Lightnings and clouds, bless the Lord. Let the earth bless the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Mountains and hills, bless the Lord. Everything growing from the earth, bless the Lord. You springs, bless the Lord. Seas and rivers, bless the Lord. You dolphins and all water creatures, bless the Lord. 
All you birds of the air, bless the Lord. All you beasts, wild and tame, bless the Lord. You sons of men, bless the Lord. O Israel, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Priests of the Lord, bless the Lord. Servants of the Lord, bless the Lord. Spirits and souls of the just, bless the Lord. Holy men of humble heart, bless the Lord. Ananiah, Azariah, Mishael, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Let us bless the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Let us praise and exalt him above all forever. Blessed are you, Lord, in the firmament of heaven, praiseworthy and glorious and exalted above all forever. All, all creations will, will be freed. freed. All, all peoples will, will know the glory and freedom of God's children. Hallelujah. The name of the Lord is praised in heaven and on earth. Alleluia. Praise the Lord from the heavens. Praise Him in the heights. Praise Him, all His angels. Praise Him, all His hosts. Praise Him, sun and moon. Praise Him, shining stars. Praise Him, highest heavens and the waters above the heavens. Let them praise the name of the Lord. He commanded. They were made. He fixed them forever gave a new law which shall not pass away. Praise the Lord from the earth, seas, creatures, creatures and all oceans, fire and hail, snow and mist, stormy winds that obey his word. All mountains and hills, all fruit trees and cedars, beasts wild and tame, reptiles and birds on the wing. All earths, kings and peoples, earth's princes and rulers, young men and maidens, old men together with children. Let them praise the name of the Lord, for He alone is exalted. The splendor of His name reaches beyond heaven and earth. He exalts the strength of His people. He is pra the praise of all His saints, of the sons of Israel, of the people to whom He comes close. Glory to the Father and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The name Amen. of the, the Lord, Lord is praised in heaven and on earth. Hallelujah. A reading from the Acts of the Apostles. God raised up Jesus on the third day and granted that he be seen, not by all, but by only by such witnesses as had been chosen before by God, by us who ate and drank with him, after he rose from the dead. He commissioned us to preach to the people and bear witness that he is the one set apart by God as judge of the living and the dead. To him all the prophets testify, saying that everyone who believes in him has forgiveness of sins through his name. The word of the Lord. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God. You are chosen. We are chosen beforehand by God as the bearer of the word of salvation. God wants us to preach to the people that Jesus is the one set apart by God as judge of the living and the dead. Death for our earthly bodies is inevitable. Death is the final boundary of the natural human life. But the resurrection of Jesus reminds us that we are not in control. We are called to bear witness that the resurrected Christ is the Lord of all. Now, how do we bear witness? We bear witness when we proclaim God's word 
God's love to others. We bear witness when others see Jesus in us, not just through our words, but through our actions. We bear witness when Jesus lives in our heart, visible through the selfless love we share to others. Christ, Son of the living God, have mercy on us. Alleluia, alleluia. Christ, Son of, Son of the, the living God, God have mercy on us. Alleluia, alleluia. You have risen from the dead. Alleluia, alleluia. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Christ, Son of the living God, have mercy on us. Alleluia, alleluia. Father, I have glorified you upon the earth. I have accomplished the work you gave me to do. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets, he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Father, Father I have glorified you upon the earth. earth. I have accomplished the work you gave me to do. Alleluia. In company with all who have been reconciled with the Father by the power of the Holy Spirit, let us join in prayer and praise, saying, May, May your Spirit, Spirit come, come to our aid. Lord Jesus, may we be guided today by God's spirits and, and walk, walk always as children, children of your Father. Father. Through your Spirit, intercede for us with the Father, that, that we may be, be made worthy to receive what you promise. promise. Give us a generous heart that we may not seek our selfish interests, but, but be concerned for the good of others. Teach us to know God, that, that we may advance in knowledge of you and the Father through the Holy Spirit. At this time, let's um, take a moment of silence to lift up our prayers and our petitions to our Lord Jesus Christ. Dear Lord Jesus, we lift up to you our prayers and our petitions, together with the prayers and petitions of each and every one who are praying with us this morning. We ask, dear Jesus, that you hear and answer each and every prayer as we say, May your Spirit come to our aid. Gathering our prayers and praises into one, we now pray the prayer your Son Jesus has taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, 
but deliver us from evil. Amen. Let us pray. Father, help us keep in mind that Christ, our Savior, lives with you in glory and promise to remain with us until the end of time. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. Amen. May, May the, the Lord, Lord bless, bless us, protect, protect us from, from all evil, evil, and bring us to everlasting life. life. Amen. Amen. Thank you for praying with us. We hope you can join us again tomorrow. Same time. Same place. Same, same channel. channel. Have, Have a great, great day. day.